we got 12 games to get to, but last week, not our best. Two and six on my end, one and six on your end, two and five on Serge's end. It's uh, ugly. It's tough. <laughs> That's an ugly week. But you know what? We have 12 games this week. So hopefully we can improve. We could be like TFC. You just got to win the next game. <laughs> well, it's, I mean, that's what I did. I was awful the first few weeks. Now I'm in the lead. Uh, so we'll see how this goes. But 12 matches. Okay, let's uh, let's start off with Sergio. He sent us a video. So here's his. Hey, for your first fans, we've got a lot of games this week. So let me make this short and sweet. we got Atletico Ottawa Forge. I'm going Forge. Toronto FC, DC United. I'm going tie there. Come on, TFC. CF Montreal into Miami. I'm taking Montreal at home. St. Louis Whitecaps. I'm taking St. Louis at home. Pacific Halifax. I'm taking Pacific at home. Going heavy on the home teams here. York and Cavs. That's our game of the week. So I'll let Nick have all the fun there predicting that one. Vancouver FC. Valor FC. I'm taking Valor FC away. Toronto FC versus Chicago Fire. I'm taking Chicago Fire. DC United, CF Montreal, I'm taking DC United. Whitecaps, Houston Dynamo, let's go Whitecaps. Forge and York, this is a little Ontario upset. I'm going York, come on Nico. Only after a defeat to Cavs though. Vancouver FC versus Pacific, I gotta go with the stronger hand here and I'm gonna go with Pacific. Enjoy. There you have it. He did 11 matches because obviously our game of the week, we're doing something a little different this week. We're going to predict your match. And it's the match that you guys are playing against each other. So I'm really the only one predicting. So it's a little weird for me, but we'll see how it goes. But 11 other games here, Nico. Let's get right through, right to them, right through them all. Ready? Atletico at home to Forge. Uh, I'm going to go a draw in this game. I think Forge is going to be tired after the Can Champ game. So draw. Atletico will probably sit back as they do. Yeah, and you know what? I kind of like the draw in this one as well for the exact same reason. It's just a lot of matches for Forge in the last few weeks. It's going to catch up to them eventually, right? It's a banana peel game for Forge. They could lose this one, and they should, no one should yeah. really worry. Uh, TFC at home to DC United. Ah, I got TFC to take <laughs> the win on this one. Come on, boys. Up the Reds. I'm going to take a draw just because, as you mentioned earlier, DC, lots of injuries too. I'm going to go draw. Uh, CF Montreal at home to Inter Miami. Uh, I'm going to take Inter. I'm going to take the draw on this one. A draw on this one, yeah. And I'm going to take Inter Miami. So I think we're on the same page. I think you like it either one of those options, but I think we're going to go that way. Check out the edge. Uh, St. Louis at home against the Whitecaps. Ooh. Uh, for the same reason of Whitecaps having that midweek game, I'm going to go St. Louis, and they're at home as well. Yeah, I'm going St. Louis in this one as well. Also, also the Ali Ahmed injury, how much is that going to mentally affect the team? Like, that's that's a lot. So Could do the opposite, though. Could it could do the opposite, but we'll see. in a short week, I just worry about that. Uh, Pacific at home to Halifax. Pacific taking the win. I saw a random stat. Did you know Halifax has made the most passes this year in the CPL? No, we could. That that's, that's incredible to me because they just aren't doing anything offensively, but they have the most passes. I'm taking Pacific as well. <laughs> Uh, skip your game, Vancouver FC hosting Valor. Valor, just to take the win there. Yeah, I like Valor in this one as well. I think they're just they're starting to find their footing. So. Vancouver FC dealing with issues, uh, injury issues as well. Exactly. Uh, TFC at home to Chicago Fire. I got TFC to win two games on the two games in one week, two wins. I'm gonna go with the Fire in this one. I took the draw against DC, but the Fire have some potent offensive players. If they get a chance, they'll take it. DC United hosting Montreal. Draw. Draw. I'm going to take Montreal in this one. Uh, Whitecaps at home to Houston. Uh, I'm also going to take a draw in this game as well. All right. Two great keepers. These are two of my favorite keepers to watch yeah. in the MLS. Takaoka, I've really enjoyed watching him. And Steve Clark, OG for me. This is the first <laughs> keeper I looked up to. Uh, Steve Clark and goal. Any young goalkeepers that have a chance to watch this game, watch the way these two compete. Yeah, I'm going to take the Whitecaps. I like how they've played, and I think... One game after the Can Champ game, that'll give them a bit more of a boost. Uh, that's your game, so we're going to skip that one. It's Forge United, York United. I'm taking Forge in that one, but I think it's going to be like a 1 0 game. Like both teams are coming into this playing much better. So I like this match, but it's going to be a tough one for you guys. Inside info on that one, but I'm not going to. Uh, Vancouver FC hosting Pacific, the BC Derby. The BC Derby. And for that reason, I'm going to take Pacific. 
to get a win. Convincing win. Yeah, I'm going to take Pacific as well, but they've played a lot of matches. So I could also see this one ending in a draw, but I'm taking Pacific. And then the last game, I guess it's York, Cavs. Explain as well. I want okay, to we, we don't have it down. We don't have a ton of time, so I got to get through this quickly. But, okay, I'm leaning York in this one. And you guys have been playing very strong the last few matches. I think defensively, you're starting to get healthier, which helps, obviously. And there's only so long that you can keep Brian Wright and Ozaze off the score sheet. And I think Austin Ricci has had a revelation of a season so far. He looks revitalized. He looks brand new. And he looks fantastic. So I, I know you have. And I'm, it's now showing because he's getting more playing time. So it's easier for me to be like, yes, I see it. Cavs, they're playing well too. It's going to be a tough match, but because you guys have the home field advantage, I'm going with you guys win the win. I think it's going to be a 2-1 game. So that's my prediction, 2-1 York. And I will pull out the jersey too. <laughs> I have a Cavs one at home. Eventually I'll have to pull that out for, <laughs> for Serge. He's going to hate me every time I, I've picked against his team so far since he's been on this show. Who cares so 